literally right now so right now like literally right now as i'm getting ready to leave the crib y'all as i'm getting ready to leave the crib i get a dm from one of the 2k workers now I'm not gonna really say his name because if I say his name, it's like y'all not gonna know who I'm talking about. But as I'm getting ready to leave the crib, y'all, I get a DM from one of the 2K workers. And I already know what this DM is finna be about because I got this last message last year for 2K23. And I know what this finna be about, y'all. And I'm gonna I'm be honest with y'all. I'm gonna be very honest. I did not expect this. You wanna know why? Because I feel like I didn't grind 2K23 as much as I should have but i'm not even gonna lie i'm not gonna put no fault on myself for that you feel me it just wasn't something that i enjoyed and it's like i'm not going to force myself to play something it's something the whole community did enjoy we all know that so we're not even gonna talk about that or even bash the game because we already know this now i'm honestly shocked because i did not expect this like i still didn't expect this because i feel like i didn't grind the game you know what i'm saying but i'm gonna be honest i am completely shocked because i'm gonna keep saying this i feel like i did not grind this game i feel like i didn't grind this game as much as i just didn't grind the game so i didn't expect this so let me go and stop being around the bush now look y'all i got a dm from evan and he said hey do you still make NBA 2K content? And I know why he asked that because if y'all know, I did upload a video saying that I was going to be leaving the 2K community, but I just couldn't do it. You know what I'm saying? Although I wanted to at the time, I just couldn't because it's like, y'all, that's what y'all like to see me play, you know? But he DM me, asked me, do I still make 2K content? I said, yes. I just stream mostly now. And... I'm so shocked, bro. I'm literally shocked because I did not expect this. I did not expect it, but since we got this, I know what this message means. I don't need no other further explanation. I know what this message means because I got the same message for 2K23 Community Day invite. Like, he said, no worries at all. I'll message you on Discord. Okay, hold on real quick. Let's go to Discord. Oh, yeah. That's what it is, y'all. Your girl done got invited to NBA 2K24 community. Look, bro. We got invited to 2K24 community day. Like, I'm shocked. I don't care what y'all say. Y'all probably think I'm not shocked. I'm shocked, bro. I made a whole video saying I was going to leave the community. And I didn't even grind the game for real. I'm shocked. This honestly is a blessing, bro. I want to thank the man above. This is literally a blessing. I want to thank 2K2 because they still ain't give up on your girl. They ain't have to invite me, bro. I made a whole video leaving the community. I made a whole video saying about how the game was, but we all know this. I feel like they know that also. They see it enough from us as 2K content creators. But he said, hey, want to discuss an upcoming NBA 2K event with you. If you're interested, could you please sign and return this link below? Now, I know what this link is. If y'all don't know, we have to sign NBAs, be NDAs before we're able to announce this news. Like, we have to sign NDAs. We literally be knowing we got invited to 2K Community Day weeks before the actual event, really a month before. But we don't say anything on social media because we cannot speak. We have to sign an NDA. So, boom, I'm going to sign that because I already know what it's about. Boom. Bro, okay, I just signed an NDA. It's nothing long. I don't have to read it. All I have to do is put my signature on it because I already know about this. I already did this before with 2K23 Community Day. So, I just texted him and told him I signed the NDA. He just texted me saying, we'd like to invite you to NBA 2K24 Community Day. The location, New York City. We going to New York, bro? They got their thing in New York this year. I done been to New York before. And I always said I wanted to go again, even though I feel like it's tr it's like a trash, it looks trashy, but it's still a great experience. So for them to have it in New York, bro, I'm, I, bro, I'm, look, I like that. I like that. In LA, it was, it was, it was, it was cool. It was, it was, it was fire in LA though. I ain't gonna lie. LA was pretty nice. The scenery there is pretty nice, but I feel like LA is a little similar to New York. It looks a little... I don't, I don't, I ain't gonna speak about it, but LA was really crazy now. LA real crazy. I seen the people on the street doing a little, huh, I ain't talking about no weed. Anyways, get off that. But I got the invite. I got the invite to NBA 2K24 Community Day. Everything covered, flight, hotel room, 
all of that. I'm just eager to see, bro. I'm eager to see who they invited this year because I feel like there's a lot of content creators that came up this year with 2K23 to the people who still grinded the game. So I'm eager to see who they invited this year. Honestly, I'm eager to see 2K23 Community Day was a W. They invited a lot of good people. I just want to see who they invited this time. I feel like they should definitely invite some people that never got the opportunity, most definitely. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I would love to see my boy Pugata get invited, but who knows how that go. You know what I'm saying? Like, people like that. You get what I'm saying? Like, people who... I, I would like them to still invite people who give out that toxic wave, but... They still play the game. They're still giving you, your, you guys game recognition. They're still, like, playing you guys game, advertising it. So regardless of how they're doing it, I still feel like they should get an invite. You know what I'm saying? But I'm very excited for this opportunity, something that I did not expect. Like, no, I did not expect this. I'm going to be 100% honest with y'all. I did not expect this, honestly. So I'm excited, bro. Uh, the event will be... In August, um, this, um, this, I'm getting this in July. This is going to be in August, so I'm not going to say the dates. All that. I'm not going to disclose all that information. Boom, boom, boom. We don't need no people pulling up. We don't need none of that. But, uh, bro, I'm excited, man. Big shout out to 2K for this opportunity. And I wish, I hope that I can get invited to many more. And I'm honestly saying this now. I'm grinding 2K24. I have to, bro. If this game is good at Community Day, we're grinding this game. Facts. Facts. Hey, spell the W's down in the comment section, bro. If y'all in New York, let me know. We can link up. If I got some supporters in New York, we can link up. No cap. For sure, for sure. But I'm going to end this video off right here. You don't have to make this long, bro. This just was like my reaction. Like, I'm, I'm shocked, bro. I'm shocked. Like, no cap. But... I'm excited. I can't wait to see. I can't I can't wait for the day. I can't honestly can't wait for the day. But I'll see you boys and girls in the next video, man. Thank y'all for all the support and love. I will not let you guys down this year. I will honestly be grinding this game as long as this is a good game. But I feel like I'm still gonna grind it as long even if it's a bad game. But I got high hopes for 2K24. So um I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure y'all subscribe to my second channel. Um drop a like on this video, subscribe here if you're new, turn on notifications. And go follow me on Twitch. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do 2K24, but I'm going to make me a schedule for uploading and a schedule for streaming. I don't think I'm going to be streaming on YouTube. Twitch is definitely the way because streaming on YouTube, it just messes up your um, your watch time for your videos. But that's going to be a whole different other topic. But I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Peace out.